Have you ever heard his son sing? No. No. <laughs> he did a, I did some research too. He did a school project where he sang and a song that it, it felt like Ed Sheeran. Really? What? I'm not lying. Yes. I, I swear on my life. My son was like 13 and the, he was in school and they were like, hey, you, you have to do a project on the Holocaust. And, um, and he was like, Ah, uh, okay, okay. He's like, well, can he goes to the teachers like, can I write a song about the Holocaust? About the Holocaust, Whoa. yeah. And we're Jewish, so you know, close <laughs> to our hearts. And um, and we're like, don't write a song, Wyatt. Just just do the project. Just do the project <laughs> on the Holocaust. And he's like, no, 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 no. He's like, this I, is I, my vision. <laughs> this is my artistic vision. Yeah, 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 yeah. So. He doesn't do it. He doesn't do it. And we're on him for like, you know, a month. We're like, you've got to finish your Holocaust project. <laughs> <laughs> they were saying the same thing about Hitler, unfortunately. They've got to finish it. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, and so the night before, he's up till four in the morning. We're yelling at him. And then I, I go in there at like, you know, two or three in the morning. And I'm like, yo, I'm like, you got to go to bed. Like you have school in like two, three, two, three hours. And he's like, he's like, okay, I'm almost done. And he like hits the space bar on the computer. And then the most beautiful song about the Holocaust comes out. Like, really? It's fucking bone chilling. It's like, it's like, it's got soldiers marching. It's like, gar, ar, ar, bar, you know, and it's got like sirens and- um, Okay, it's not true. Okay, what I'm about to say is very not true, but it was almost worth- No, the, Zach. The song's Zach. good. The song's good. Uh, Zach. <laughs> The song is great. Oh, Every bad thing brings a rose. <laughs> imagine. I want to hear this song. No, imagine God is like, okay, so we're going to have this thing where kill, it, it extinction a ton of people, but one day in about 2018, this kid <laughs> is going to write this song <laughs> that is going mean, to be worth world. it. And all the angels are like, I don't know about this one, God. Um, no, trust me, trust me. Hitler um, lives so my son could walk. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> Uh, and yeah, and then great it, band name. It was a cool. It was cool. And uh, did I, your son have any like uh, interest in music before then, or like did you know he was like <laughs> getting into production or singing or anything? Does like he do that? music now? Oh yeah, yeah. He's been playing guitar since he was like I don't know six or seven. Or oh, okay. I've got to show you the whatever it is. The Holocaust. The Holocaust song. I want to hear. You it. have it? Is it up? Is it online? I it's think. on. It's on. It was on. Oh yeah, it is online. It was on a podcast. Oh, it's on our podcast, right? Oh, right, here we go. Oh, you got it. I found it. How'd you find it so quick? That was. I just looked up. I haven't heard Holocaust this. Song. This is so cool because I haven't heard this in a long time. I, I looked up. Can wow. you have it play through our ears? Also, Wyatt Nash Holocaust song. Yeah, this is for his school project. <laughs> Listen to this. What the fuck, Jason? <laughs> <laughs> I got me working like a slave. <laughs> 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 oh my god, you're making David's face right now. <laughs> he was listening to a lot of Arctic Monkeys then. I, I was going to say, yeah. I was like, it was uh, definitely uh, some uh, influence. Arctic Monkeys. Some 21 Pilots. Yeah. Yeah. Wait, this is Wyatt's voice? Yeah. Oh, wow. That was weird. I, I just thought Natalie was yeah, in the room for a second. Most my family's gone. Two in the morning. Two in the morning, I'm like, what the oh fuck? You're like, we got to give this one back to the hospital. Faces came to ghetto. And the false happiness It's now incredible Just beaten in head I wanna go home It's five minutes and 37 seconds, by the way yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh oh. That was fantastic I, I, That was crazy Then I'm just kind of standing there like Okay, good job. Keep working. <laughs> went, okay, well, get some sleep, bud. It's yeah. like it's like I don't know if I should be like you got an A or we should do a post birth abortion so you don't take over the world. <laughs> like I don't, it's, it's a little terrifying. But it is is it not a beautiful? And so he a post birth abortion. It's topical. It's topical. Okay, no. I don't even know what that is. Post. That's just murder. That's just murder. It's murder. <laughs> <laughs> right, right, right. No, no. Uh, okay. Am yeah. I so right? then, so then, uh, the funny thing is that he would always ask my his little sister to sing with him because she can sing pretty good, and she would say no, 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 no. And then after that, uh, Phineas heard it, and now, and then that was like the, the artist. Yeah, and then that was like oh, a big talk around the house. So, so like as it I, should be. I would walk up to Charlie. I'd be like, uh, "You want to work with Wyatt? Well, Phineas likes him." 
She was like, I know, I heard it. That, that's the way. If, if he's still singing, Jared, I'm not even lying, is a fantastic producer. They should just. Oh, really? Uh, I just would riff. love to work with him. No, I, I, I did I not lie. You thought I was going to be like, it's just some little kid going, the Holocaust is bad. It's really, really bad. <laughs> Instead, it's, I don't know, got humor. You know, you know what's funny, too, is like, I've noticed this, too. I, I don't think he's like someone that wants to be the, the front of anything. Really? Yeah. And so, that, those make the best artists, though, because they're not do doing it with vanity. They're doing right. it in a storytelling kind of way. Yes, yes. That's the coolest thing about being a kid too is like when I go watch their plays like or when I go watch them play their jazz combo or whatever. There is there's no vanity in it. There's yeah. no showmanship. It's like they're playing exactly what they've been taught and they're just trying to play it well. And it's really inspiring. In the yeah. least creepy way, we'd love to watch your kids play instruments sometime. Well, <laughs> yeah. Come over. He's at um he's he's at or if he has a jazz thing or whatever it is. Oh, we love jazz. We here. do yeah. love jazz. I, I was listening to jazz all morning. So really? yeah. Yeah, love yeah. It. Oh come, come. Well, I'll take you guys. They have concerts all the time. He's oh, at oh, Berkeley School of Music right now for oh, camp. Oh wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait, how old is he? He's sixteen. Oh, he's like, Jesus. Oh my gosh. I dropped him off and lived like living in a he's living in a dorm there. And I like said goodbye to him and and um and I like started crying saying goodbye. And then I didn't want him to see that I was crying. So I was like, okay, see you later. <laughs> <laughs> And then I was walking away and I look up and I just saw Gwyneth Paltrow just looking at me. <laughs> it was so fucking She's bizarre. like, you want to smell my vagina candle? <laughs> and you're like, no, Gwyneth. I'm, I'm dropping my kid off right now. Please, this is a really emotional moment. <laughs> oh my God. She looked amazing. And then I'm like crying looking at her like, oh my God, this is the most beautiful woman I've ever seen. <laughs> and um, yeah, and then I just like hit my face and that was it. Oh God. But yeah, so he's doing good. 